how's it going? It's Jasper from No More Coast here. Um, it's been a while. In this new software tutorial, I'll be showing you how you can uh, set up a quick reset password flow for your user. Uh, this uh, step usually is not something that uh, people usually would build initially, um, but it is a very important uh, part to improve your user experience for your end users, um, especially if your goal is to have a lot of users to uh, to be on your platform all the time and then it's a crucial part so let's see how we can quickly set this up um, to set up the reset password flow you will need three pages uh, on your application um, the login page um, forgot password page and reset password page and in each page you will have the uh, for, for example in login page we have the login block um, the forgot password uh, page on the forgot um, uh, forgot password block on the forgot password page and then reset password block in reset password page um, Okay, let's go into login page first. Um, you will need to have a link here uh, For the login page you will have the link here to direct your users to um, forgot password page uh, and in the forgot password page uh, you can simply just add your forgot password block and then customize the message and style to your liking. Um, lastly, uh, we're going to add reset password block uh, to your reset password page. Uh, and hit, uh, we can hit publish. So you are done with the reset password flow. Um, the entire user journey for the user, uh, your end user would be that uh, the user will click on the forgot password link from the login page, um, which then direct them to the forgot password page where they will input their account email. Um, and once they enter the email, they are prompted to go to their email inbox for the reset password page link. And we can see that uh, in my email um, inbox, we have received a link sent from Softer. Um, the user then click on the link and then come to your reset password page and then reset their passwords. Uh, a very simple flow, but a super important step to make your application more user-friendly and more uh, robust. Um, one extra thing is that you can, uh, something extra you can do here is to customize your email signature, which essentially is the way your um, email, like the one to reset password, will look like in your user's inbox. Uh, without any configuration, right now by default, any email you send to your uh, from your software application will actually be sent um, from software's email domain, and which is completely fine. Uh, but if you want more control, you want you want to make your application look more professional and with a more branded look, uh, you can come to the settings and scroll down to find email signature. In here, you can then set. Um, customize your name and also the email address you uh, um, email address that your reset password email is going to be sent from uh, note that you can't uh, you can only use email address from a custom domain for example you have a, a custom domain and then you can set up your uh, email addresses under that domain um, this means that uh, for example if you're using gmail or hotmail accounts uh, this will not work this only works for your custom domain emails um, but if you have your own email from your own domain, you can simply just put it here and save it. Now, um, any email sent from your software application will be sent from your own email address as opposed to um, from uh, notification at software.com, like this one. And the software team title will be replaced by your uh, sender name that you just set in your settings. And there you have it. Um, this is how you can quickly set up a reset password flow and also um, to customize your e uh, email signature. I uh, hope this video helped. Uh, if you liked it, um, any likes, any subscribe, any sharing um, will help me greatly. Um, yeah, and let me know if there's any other type of very um, simple flow that you want to know how to set up in Softer. Uh, or if there's any other topic that you want you want me to make videos about. Uh, until next time, ciao.